Hey guys, Reese back again. Going to be going over the solo for Chasing the Edge. There's plenty of notes, plenty to go over. Let's do this. Alright, so let's go piece by piece with Chasing the Edge. Lots of arpeggios, lots of tapping, no shortage of notes. So what I wanted to do was write a spaced out solo for a spaced out lyric concept. The song is about space, so I made it sound as spacey as possible. Um, lots of arpeggios, and we'll start with the first one. We're in the key of A, and we're flirting, like what I like to say, flirting with the key of E and you'll see what I mean. Let's do this. So, do that one more time. All right, and then moving on, we go on to a diminished arpeggio lick that everyone does, but it's rad, and so I did it too. resolving at the 17th fret. But using these fingers to reinforce the ring finger to add for killer vibrato. Bend it, squeal it, add some life into it. Okay, so I have a section, an E, that basically breaks up the first arpeggio section and all the craziness that's going on there and what's going to happen at the end of the solo um, with the tapping and the you know, chromatic tapping. So it goes like this. One more time. Okay, so now moving on to the big tapping lick. Um, the first part is all chromatic. We're using that same A arpeggio and adding a tap at the 17th fret and basically moving it down a half step, a half step, a half step. And it goes like this. So you got some open strings in there too with the, some pull-offs at the end of the arpeggio. And uh, what I do to make sure that I'm not losing, you know, the sound is I basically reinforce the lick with uh, a rake down to make sure that I'm not, uh, you know, my notes aren't going to die out. So. So I rake back down just so I'm like starting the cycle, you know, all over again. Moving on to the all tap lick with the string skipping. Um, it's uh, string skipping, pulling off, tapping, all the stuff combined, and it goes like this. So basically what's going on there is you're doing pull-offs and tapping and string skipping all at the same time. And the, the last part, uh, the, 
the way that I resolve it, uh, I use a different rhythm to, to break it up from the rest of, of the lick. And I'll give you one more example. So adding that rhythm uh, at, on the G string to resolve the lick is just a way of breaking up the rest of the of that lick, that section, and I thought it would be pretty neat. So that that's the end of Chasing the Edge solo. I hope you enjoyed this solo breakdown. If you want more, check out this link. If you want to watch the Chasing the Edge video, click on this. Like I said, I hope you enjoyed. I enjoyed. See you next time. The song is about space <laughs> and space uh, exploration. <laughs> <laughs> exploration. Good. Are you exploring it or are you explaining it? Um, <laughs> exploration. I just made up a new word. Let's do this.